from out west. As we've been on the air, we're hearing for the first time from a rep for Diddy, Sean Combs. Remember after the feds raided his houses in California and in Florida. We brought it to you as breaking news on this show 24 hours ago with those live aerials at the time. Well, now those reps for Combs say that this was, and I'm quoting here, a gross use of military level force and that Diddy is innocent. Remember, just the last couple of minutes, too, we're learning that the feds apparently found guns at the homes of Combs, according to three sources familiar with the matter. Diddy is now at the center of this federal investigation, with multiple people being interviewed by federal officials in New York related to allegations of sex trafficking, assault, and more against the rapper, according to its sources tell NBC. And that says NBC is learning exclusively that the music producer accusing Diddy of sexual assault and harassment is also accusing actor Cuba Gooding Jr., this producer filed the original lawsuit last month, accusing Combs of forcing him to find sex workers and pressuring him into doing sexual things with them. Now, he's saying Gooding groped and fondled him while they were on Combs' yacht. No comment from Gooding's reps yet. Dana Griffin is joining us now, but tell us more about what Diddy's reps are saying about all of this here. Yeah, Hallie, they just released a statement within the last hour. I'm going to read parts of it. They call this a gross overuse of military-level force. They go on to say that there is no excuse for the excessive show of force and hostility exhibited by authorities or the way his children and employees were treated. It also mentions... They call this an unprecedented ambush and also note that this is a premature rush to judgment of Mr. Combs. And it wraps up saying that Mr. Combs is innocent and will continue to fight every single day to clear his name. Hallie? What about this lawsuit from the music producer now accusing not just Combs, but Cuba Gooding Jr. as well? Important to note that Gooding has not been charged with any crime. Talk us through some of that. Yeah. So this producer, Rodney Jones, amended his lawsuit to now say that Cuba Gooding Jr., according to the suit, groped him while he was on a yacht in 2023 with Diddy in the Virgin Islands. And I want to read part of that as well. In the suit, he claims that Mr. Jones believes Mr. Combs was grooming him to pass him off to his friends. He also alleges that he rejected Mr. Gooding's advances and that Mr. Gooding Jr. did not stop until Mr. Jones forcibly pushed him away. Now, this suit is, is has not said a specific amount of damages, but this uh, this this. Um, excuse me, this producer says that he worked on Diddy's latest album, which was released in 2023. It also was nominated for a Grammy. So we have reached out to both representatives for Diddy and Cuba Gooding Jr. on these latest allegations, and we have yet to hear back. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.